Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about fault code P2188, system too rich at idle. This is a common code that can be caused by a number of things, so we're going to go over some of the most common causes and how to diagnose them. We'll also talk about some of the potential solutions, so if you're experiencing this code, be sure to check out this video. The P2188 code indicates that the engine control module, ECM, has detected a fuel to air ratio that is too rich at idle. This means that there is too much fuel and not enough air in the combustion chamber, which can lead to several problems, including increased emissions, reduced fuel economy, poor engine performance, engine damage. There are several possible causes of the P2188 code, including faulty oxygen sensor. The oxygen sensor is responsible for measuring the amount of oxygen in the exhaust gases. If the oxygen sensor is faulty, it may send an incorrect signal to the ECM, which can cause the ECM to add too much fuel. Vacuum leak. A vacuum leak can cause the engine to run too rich because it allows unmetered air to enter the engine. Fuel injector problem. A faulty fuel injector can cause too much fuel to be injected into the engine. Mass airflow sensor, MAF, problem. The MAF sensor measures the amount of air entering the engine. If the MAF sensor is faulty, it may send an incorrect signal to the ECM, which can cause the ECM to add too much fuel. Exhaust leak. An exhaust leak can cause the engine to run too rich because it allows oxygen to enter the exhaust system before the oxygen sensor. Clogged air filter. A clogged air filter can restrict airflow to the engine, which can cause the engine to run too rich. Faulty fuel pressure regulator. The fuel pressure regulator controls the amount of fuel pressure in the fuel system. If the fuel pressure regulator is faulty, it may allow too much fuel to be delivered to the engine. Incorrect fuel type. Using the wrong type of fuel can cause the engine to run too rich. If you are experiencing the P2188 code, it is important to have the problem diagnosed and repaired by a qualified mechanic. Ignoring this code can lead to serious engine damage. Here are some additional tips for troubleshooting the P2188 code. Check the oxygen sensor for proper operation. Inspect the intake system for vacuum leaks. Clean the MAF sensor. Check the fuel pressure regulator. Use the correct type of fuel. By following these tips, you can help to diagnose and repair the P2188 code and get your car running smoothly again. The P2188 code indicates that the engine control module, ECM, has detected a rich fuel mixture at idle. This means that there is too much fuel and not enough air in the combustion chamber. This can lead to several symptoms, including rough idle, the engine may idle erratically or stall, black smoke from the exhaust. This is a sign that the engine is burning too much fuel. Increased fuel consumption. The engine will use more fuel than normal. Check engine light. The check engine light will illuminate on the dashboard. There are several things that can cause the P2188 code. Some of the most common causes include vacuum leak. A vacuum leak can cause the engine to run rich because it allows unmetered air into the intake manifold. Faulty oxygen sensor. The oxygen sensor is responsible for measuring the amount of oxygen in the exhaust. If the oxygen sensor is faulty, it may send an incorrect signal to the ECM, which can cause the engine to run rich. Fuel injector problem. A stuck or leaking fuel injector can cause the engine to run rich by delivering too much fuel. Mass airflow sensor, MAF, problem. The MAF sensor measures the amount of air entering the engine. If the MAF sensor is faulty, it may send an incorrect signal to the ECM, which can cause the engine to run rich. To diagnose the P2188 code, you will need to use a scan tool to read the trouble codes from the ECM. Once you have the trouble codes, you can use a repair manual or online resources to help you diagnose the problem. The repair for the P2188 code will depend on the underlying cause of the problem. Some common repairs include repairing the vacuum leak. This may involve replacing a hose or gasket. Replacing the oxygen sensor. This is a relatively simple repair that can be done by most home mechanics. Cleaning or replacing the fuel injectors. This is a more complex repair that should be done by a qualified mechanic. Replacing the MAF sensor. This is a relatively simple repair that can be done by most home mechanics. If you are not comfortable repairing your vehicle yourself, you should take it to a qualified mechanic.